How to rent and set up a towable lift. First, you'll want to inspect the equipment. You are responsible for any damage that happens to the equipment while you have it on rent. Connect the lift to your vehicle. You will need at least a half ton pickup truck capable of towing 44 to 4800 pounds of weight. Once the hitch is attached to the ball of your vehicle, you can move the front support into the stowed position. Now latch the hitch and insert the safety pin, safety chains, and safety breakaway brake actuator. You will need a flat floor wiring connector for the trailer lights. Don't forget to release the parking brake. Once you arrive at the job site, you will have to disconnect the lift from your vehicle. You cannot put the lift into operation while it's connected to a vehicle. The control panel has a ground or basket selector, a battery status light, and a stop switch. On the left hand side are the outrigger controls, and on the right hand side are the platform controls. You'll need two fingers to operate the platform, one to select a function and one to select a speed. Turn the selector to ground and if it doesn't come to life, pull the stop switch. There's also a stop switch in the basket. In order to put the outriggers into operating position, you'll need to hit the extend button and the auto level button at the same time. Just stay on these buttons until the outrigger goes all the way down and you have double green lights on all four corners as seen in the picture. You can now unlatch the boom from the trailer there may be one or two latches depending on the model. Now turn the key from the ground position to the basket position and get in the lift and perform your work. You'll need to select a function button and a speed button to move the platform. When returning the platform to the trailer, you will again need to select a function button and a speed button to return the boom into the saddles on the trailer. The lift has a safety switch that lets it know when the basket and the boom are stored in the proper position for traveling. If the basket doesn't push that switch, then you won't be able to return the outriggers to the travel position. Turn the key from the basket position to the ground position and select the retract and auto level buttons at the same time. This will raise the outriggers. Now you can engage the boom latches, reconnect to the vehicle, and don't forget to raise the support wheel. Please stay safe and always use the appropriate safety gear when operating a lift.